Hey, man, no matter where you're from in the state of Texas, the State Fair is probably the biggest thing that's going on between September and the end of October. I mean, it's one of those things, man, we get a whole day of school out just to come to the fair, man. Whether it was to meet your girlfriend or meet up with other friends or do anything like that, you united and you came to the State Fair. Today, mm, I really don't have those kind of things on my mind because... I'm looking for the food. I want to find the best fried foods and the newest fried foods to come to the state of Texas and the state fair. So follow me, Culinary King, as I go through the state fair 2016 Choice Awards and I try it before you have to buy it. So Culinary King, I'm here with Mr. Glenn. Uh, we wanted to get started here and kind of just kind of go around and see what everybody has to offer here and uh, what they're bringing to the finalist contest. So, Mr. Glenn, what do you have here today? We've got the injectable great balls of barbecue. Oh, man, okay. It is, it's barbecue brisket. Okay. And then we've got an injector inside that. Oh. You can pump as much or as little of barbecue sauce into oh, each bite you okay. Want. So you give it to us and we can just, you can gauge how much barbecue there sauce you or how much you don't want in there. I like that. Oh, that's incredible. Fried just right. And then you've got the barbecue sauce right in there. How are you? I'm Glenn Probst from Mansfield, Texas, and I have the uh, Southern Fried Chicken and Dumplings in the Big Tex Choice Awards Finals this year. So we have uh, chicken, dumpling dough, gravy, breadcrumbs all mixed together, deep fried, a little bit of seasoned breadcrumbs on the outside. We got our biscuit bites on the side there. Caribbean pineapple cornucopia. So I want to let my man go ahead and tell me and tell us what we have here. Right, right. So basically, the Caribbean pineapple cornucopia is an island tropical type of dish. We're serving a meal in a pineapple half shell. So basically, we got our island vegetable fried rice in there. We got uh, basically Caribbean grilled chicken on one side grilled shrimp on another side, a pineapple salsa on top of it, and then we top it off with a pineapple rum glaze. Hey man, really tasty like... dish, man. Got a lot of flavors going on, different notes of flavors on each level. Yeah. And I'm, I'm trying to give them something new out here, man. You know how it is. It's all about new, man. Yes, sir. Support local black business is what we're doing. They gave me a little bit that this is what's going to be inside of the uh, inside of the full holdout half of the pineapple there. So let me just kind of get a little taste of the full deal and let you know what it is. Oh, wow. So it's kind of like a fried rice, island style. It's got a good kick to it. Chicken is charred and, and, and grilled perfect. And then you've got that good shrimp and pineapple mixture in there. So it's very good, real good. We got the deep fried burger slider here, and I don't really even know where to start. This is all inside of this, and it's on a stick. So imagine just walking through the fair, you know, you're thinking you fly, whatever, you know. Don't want to get nothing on your shirt or anything. Everything is here on the stick for you. Oh. The first thing you get is the pickle. It tastes like a all-American hot dog with mustard and ketchup and everything right there. You got bacon, cheddar cheese. I hadn't even got to the hamburger yet. Mmm. Wow. It is a macaroni and cheese sauce that has little bitty teeny fine noodles in it. And it's a great dipping sauce, you know, for chicken pot pie and macaroni and cheese. What more could you want for that? That's it. It's soothing and it is down home. I like that it's, comfort. It's kind of down home southern comfort. There it is right here. Come get you a little taste. Look, just like that. Just like you at grandma's house when she want to make you eat all the vegetables. Culinary King don't do vegetables. I'm just telling. I ain't gonna lie. 
It's not my favorite, but if you are into vegetables, that really packs a punch. As we know, I keep that pork on my fork. And say it with me, baby. Swine is always fine, baby. I love that pork. So we're gonna go right here to the Funyun Ding. What they did was they took the Funyun play and they put pulled pork inside there and they deep fried it. Come on, man. So for all you pork lovers out there and all you that don't like pork, like I say, this is one that you should try. Oh, it's even got some pineapple in there too, man. I'm telling you. Hey guys, again, we're making our way around. Here it is, the cookie fries. So basically, we took an old favorite, a crinkle french fry, okay. and put a new twist on there it. There it is. And what you get is a, is a warm, center, like oh, you think okay. it, when the cookie comes right out of the oven. Right out of the oven, guys. And we're the most creative. Um, food item that was entered into the contest. Oh yeah. So, what you think may be a crunch or a french fry is really a cookie. I mean, it's a for real cookie. Not anything like what I thought. Like I say, it is the most sought out thing after that I've heard about. Everybody talks about it. So I wish you the best of luck and I cannot wait to try it. So, my pleasure. So my pleasure. Thank you. Thank you both. Thank you both. What, what's been on my mind to come get, I promise you for the last three weeks, is this fried jello. And this is a play on childhood memories. So with no further ado, here we have the fried jello. Oh yeah, baby. Let me tell you guys, absolutely nothing about what I thought was gonna happen in there just happened. Nothing! The jello is still intact. The jello is not runny or anything like that. I thought it was just gonna ooze in my mouth like the fried butter. But no, 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 it's still intact. You got a good crunch on the outside of that, man. When you come, try it. Don't walk by it. It's Culinary King. I've been here, I've done it, I'm bringing it to you. Hey, everybody that I thought would win today, won today. So, we all walk out winners. Culinary King, I'm signing out, baby, from the State Fair 2016. prevailed on the guys to come up with something okay. comparable to the beer sales. Gotcha. We okay. had to find something to replace the beer. That makes sense. One happened to say, how about fried jello? Right. And I said, that's it. That was about, wow. about two months ago. About two, <laughs> about two months that's ago. That's it. Let's don't go that, any further. <laughs> that's it. Stop right there. Let's stop that's right it. there. And yeah. they, they, they developed it. And they did a great job, you guys. So. I want to personally thank you for having me out here. And again, you guys will not be disappointed when you come to the 2016 State Fair. Be sure, when I say it again, be sure to get the fried jello. Culinary King, we are out. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much. Anytime.